The gentleman from New Jersey is recognized for two minutes. Good morning, Mr. Speaker. Leviticus uh, chapter 19, 13, 30, 33, 34 in the Old Testament. Democrats can quote the Bible also. As a practicing Catholic, let me do that. When a foreigner resides among you in your land, do not mistreat them. The foreigner residing among you must be treated as your native born. Love them as yourself, for you are foreigners in Egypt. I am the Lord your God." Unquote. When did this, Mr. Speaker, this barbaric, xenophonic, anti-immigrant, modern agenda begin? Let's go through it quickly. One, the birther issue, an embarrassment to this country by the administration, the head of the administration. The Muslim ban. Imagine banning people that profess a particular religion. Third, Charlottesville, that debacle, equal opportunity. Fourth, the incendiary talk painted the entire Mexican population, our ally, probably our third or fourth leading trade uh, partner, our ally with a wide brush of pure prejudice, pure. He painted the entire population. And to say that Democrats are for open borders, that is a lie. You know it. I know it. I'm standing up to reject it. You sit quietly. You sit quietly and say nothing. I was on the original starting gate at the Homeland Security in the, after 9-11. Democrats, just as well as Republicans, work together to put that together. How dare anybody insinuate that we don't accept the security of this nation? And by the way, by the way, we have four borders, not one. The people who attacked us on 9-11 came from, the, from Canada. They didn't come from Mexico. You've never met a Mexican tourist, and I certainly haven't met one either. I yield back, Mr. Speaker.